Let's make this creepy icon on PowerPoint. First open up the blank slide on your PowerPoint, then go to shapes and pick this rectangle over here and just drag it over there. Done. Our first shape is ready. Then go to shape outline and click on no outline and go to shape fill and make this, this a dark ash color. Done. Now for the next part, I'll go to insert, go to shapes and pick this oval shape over here and just drag it over a bit. Done. I'll do the same thing, I'll just click on these two icons to make this the same format as the rectangle. Then I'm going to press Ctrl D to du duplicate it and put it right over here. Done. Then what I'm going to do is press on the rectangle and just you know increase the size a bit. Yep, done. Then I'm going to click on one of the circles and press Ctrl D to duplicate it and then make the color dark ash color, so dark black. Then I'm going to minimize it a bit. And put it right over here then i'm gonna press ctrl d to duplicate it again and put it right over here and this will be the eyes of the skeleton now for the teeth i'm gonna reinsert go to shapes and pick this uh pick this shape yep trapezoid and just put it right over here and maybe smooth it out a bit done then i'm gonna press ctrl d to duplicate it and put it right over here and increase it like this and put it right over here done it will create this shape then i'm going to uh, drag over all of this and go to my shapes and union them next thing go to insert go to shapes and i will just click this free form over here and just drag click 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 another click over here another click over here and it will create the loop so our shape is ready i'm gonna make it white add no shape outline and we're gonna make this thing uh, i guess this black color maybe or maybe yep this color yep, no. go to shape outline no outline so this would be the teeth all right then what i'm gonna do is just drag over all this right click then group them together to group then i'm gonna minimize it a bit yep and put it right over here but I need to click on this and make this a bit dark color done and I'm put it right over here just hold shape over here and press ctrl shift and just drag it over here ctrl shift drag it over here ctrl shift drag it over here ctrl shift drag drag you get the point right all right I'll drag all of this then I'll drag over all this go to format go to align and distribute horizontally done so this will be the teeth of the you know skeleton and for some final touch i guess i'll just drag over all of this right click then group them together and then i'm going to press ctrl d to duplicate it and just invert it like this and put it right over here yep yep and i'm going to drag over this and put it right over here done our skeleton is ready now to add some extra details i'm going to go to inside go to shapes and maybe pick this triangle and just drag it over here make it dark ash color maybe black or even and i'm going to duplicate it and just rotate it inverse it maybe yep, and put it right over here so that's how you create a skeleton on powerpoint so we are almost done we're actually done to add some more details what you can do is add more elements so i'm going to add one element more i'm going to go to insert go to shapes and so this, because it's a minimalist vector drawing i'm gonna pick this circle and just drag it over there and just duplicate it another circle over here put them right over here then go to insert go to shape and pick this and make it like this i'm going to decrease the size of the circles a bit yep done then what i'm going to do is uh, get these two circles and just keep them right over here to duplicate them and then i'm going to drag over all of this merge shapes together and then go to shape outline outline and make this black then what i'm going to do is just rotate it a bit and put it behind this thing behind the main thing created right click send to back and press ctrl d to duplicate it rotate it a bit yep done and right click send to back so our skeleton is ready i'm going to minimize a bit just drag over all of this right click to group them together and minimize them together and 
that's how you make a skeleton on PowerPoint. For more of these videos, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this YouTube channel.